famously, you were very close to Princess Diana. But even before that, you... Uh, I think you played at Prince Andrew's 21st? Yes. Um, at Windsor Castle. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and that was a very nervy experience, cos Ray Cooper, my percussion player, and myself played. And suddenly, you, you looked in the balcony, and these are all gold chairs, and suddenly they fill up, and you think, oh, God. And um, we played, and I came down, I changed, and I was in a ballroom with a band, and Diana Spencer, she wasn't Prince Charles's wife then, and she said, do you want to dance? So, I, I can't dance anyway, but we did a faux Charleston, and then we went into dinner, and then it was a buffet dinner, and then Princess Anne said, shall we go to the disco? And I said, fine, it's the quietest disco you've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> and I danced with Princess Anne thinking, you know what, I was born in a council house, it's very surreal. And then the Queen came in and she said, can we join you? And I said, say, no, fuck off, right? <laughs> <laughs> and they segued into Rock Around the Clock by Bill Haley, and I thought, this is ridiculous, because <laughs> the Queen's going like... Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> and it was one of the most, that, to that point, surreal moments of my life, because, you know, it, after being born in a council house in Pinner, and you think... And remembering Rock Around the Clock by Will Haley, you would, the odds of you dancing with the Queen at Windsor Castle that <laughs> were very, very 